I would never have believed becoming a church planter at the age of 50 during the worst health crisis of a lifetime. And yet, there I am, even in the Broadview magazine of November, page 52, if you're curious. To better explain what this project is all about, I would like to proceed by answering a simple question. What? L'Église Unie Saint Claire is a brand new community of faith in French exclusively on the internet. We began our worship services on May the 24th and people can come to worship with us via Zoom, Facebook Live, or they can watch a recording version on our YouTube channel the next day. We offer an interactive experience based a little more on conversation and sharing than uh, having a minister at the front doing his monologue. After four months, I'm very proud to say that we already have between 15 and 20 people on average for our worship services. Who do we want to reach? Don't be worried. We're not in the business of stealing sheep from other flock. Our worship services on are on Sunday night, 7.30 Eastern Time. And one of our main goal is to reach out to people at the fringe of the church. People who might not have found their place in congregation yet. People who might have bad experience in the past and might be intimidated to walk into a formal church building. People who want to engage a difficult topic. They want to ask questions in a safe and inclusive space. We also try to reach out people who might have mobility issue, I would say, who cannot attend church and now they, could, they can attend church in the comfort of their home. Why a church online? Unfortunately, in the United Church of Canada, worship service uh, are offered in French in a regular basis in Quebec City, Sherbrooke, Drummondville, Montreal, St. Adèle, Ottawa, and Toronto. That's it. If someone lives in New Brunswick, where there's a lot of people speaking French or Manitoba, there's no way to live their faith, their faith in their first language. Yes, many congregations are offering worship online during this pandemic, but the question is, what will happen when this crisis will be over? Will be some people have used the opportunity to join worship services and discover the United Church? Will they be left out? A church online, in a way, would like to abolish all the limitation due to geography. And the most important question, how? How can you help? L'Église Unie Saint Claire has received support and seen money from La Table des Ministères en Français, the Erskine and American Trust Fund, and the Foundation of the United Church of Canada, and we are very, we are very grateful for their support. Unfortunately, the reality is community of faith cannot reach um, financial sustainability during the first few years. The brand new congregation cannot. This is why I would like to invite you to become a partner in this project. You can go to our website www.idlissaintlaireinoneword.org slash donate. Don't worry if it goes too fast. The link should be above or below this video. And if you go there, you will see a button. It says, Je donne, I give. It will direct you to a Canada Helps page. 
and at the top it will say Trinity United Church Montreal. Don't worry, it's the right place. It's just that after four years, four years, sorry, after four months, we don't have a council. We don't have a treasurer. We're starting from scratch. So Trinity United and Montreal became our partner to receive our donation and manage this money. Everything is legit. Everything is good. If you cannot or would not like to use a credit card, if you would like to send us a check or just contact me, write me at my email address R-E-V-V-E-R-M at rogers.com and we will find a way to receive your donation. I just want to say in these times when we disband congregations, when we sell church buildings, at Eglise Uni saint we still believe there's hope for God's church in this 21st century. This is why we ask, please be generous today, please give, and thank you for your time and your support. God bless. Bye-bye.